The Circle Regional Protection Dialogue on the Lake Chad Basin is organized by Nigeria's Ministry of Interior in conjunction with United Nations Refugee Agency, UNHCR. This gathering see the minister from countries in the Lake Chad Basin. Speaking, Vice President Yemi Oshimbajo said Nigeria's government is committed to the protection of Lake Chad Basin. He called for synergy among member nations. In collaboration with our neighbors, we have consistently degraded the ability of the insurgents to hold territory as they had done barely four years ago. Although it is by the very nature of asymmetric warfare, this has not stopped the spate of opportunistic attacks, especially in northern Bono. Nigeria's Minister of Interior, Abdurrahman Dambazo, and Minister of Budget and National Planning lament the extent to which the Boko Haram insurgency is affecting the regional effort to protect the basin. In spite of the huge breakthrough achieved in the fight against the insurgents by the sacrificial efforts of our joint military forces, security in the basin has remained a challenge, particularly for the displaced population and other vulnerable groups. The federal government has been spearheading initiatives for bringing aid and assistance to the people and communities of the Northeast. The UN Resident Humanitarian Coordinator, Edward Callon, and other agencies while briefing journalists after the meeting lament that the humanitarian assistance is reducing. The people in, need of, the people in acute need of food security is improving. Thanks to cash transfers and thanks to food and seed supplies by uh, WFP, FAO and other agencies. The number of people that are now food insecure, meaning they cannot eat enough in a day, is down to 1.7 million. So that is an important decrease. Al Bala, ITV News, Abuja.